School District 2 has a big decision to make regarding Emily Pennington's future. State law allows for students with special needs to receive education up until the age of 21, but school districts don't have to. And now we're learning more about why the district is having such a hard time with making this decision. Meet Emily Pennington. This high school junior is 18 and has a lot in common with many of her classmates. I really love sports. A lot. But unlike most kids at West High, Emily has Down syndrome and has faced one challenge after another ever since she was born. She um, had open heart surgery and then she had a rare seizure disorder and then she had leukemia all before she was three. Because of those challenges, Emily's parents made the difficult decision to hold her back a year when she was in kindergarten. At that time it was just better for her um, educationally and also her social development. Fast forward a decade to now and that decision may come back to haunt the Penningtons. School district policy states schools don't have to enroll students once they've turned 19. Students essentially age out. The Penningtons knew that when they made that decision. I said I'm sure there's going to be new legislation within that 12 year span that would allow her to be able um, to graduate. Emily turns 19 this July, and her family had hoped House Bill 233 was that new legislation. The law, passed last year, allows school districts to extend high school education to special needs kids up until the age of 21, but not so fast, says District 2 Superintendent Greg Upham. It's not about Emily. I mean, Emily obviously is at the, at the core of this, but it's about all the students that a decision like this would impact moving forward. Upham says he's worried about the precedent and whether the state would provide enough funding in the future for others. This is all making sure that as we look at this and we look to the future, can we support our students as we're required to support them moving forward by adding more students to more years of schooling. The district is still evaluating the situation, and while they do, the Penningtons aren't just going to sit back. Just because it's a policy and it's been there for 10 years doesn't mean it's a good policy. They say they aren't giving up on their miracle baby because they know her future is bright. I don't want, like, working at being, like, a teacher. In Billings, Alina Howder, MTN News.